Jackie. Uh, I was thinking, I know we usually give each other gifts, mm. but uh, maybe this year we could give each other extra special gifts? Yes! Uh, I was thinking the same thing. Here! Oh! Open it, open it, okay. open it. Okay. Oh, okay, you really know how to wrap a gift up, like, really well. Oh! And here! Check it. Huh? Oh! This is the most amazing, thoughtful, incredible gift imaginable! <laughs> Or the second most amazing gift after the one I'll be giving you very, very soon. Uh, just have to wrap it <laughs> and get it. Uh, oh, what's that, Pogi? Mm -hmm. Coming! <laughs> Uncle Traveling Matt, how are you? Good morning. Who's this? Well, this is Paul Southman from Dallas, Texas. Oh my gosh, Dallas. It's a wonderful place. I must go there sometime. Well, you definitely should. We have more fun here than you can imagine. Are you speaking to me through your doozer tube? Yes, I am. I'm speaking to you through my doozer tube. I need one of those. Well, you know, I'm one of those silly creatures from outer space that you love to find. Absolutely. And so what's it like in outer space today? It's a beautiful day in Texas, but it feels like outer space sometimes. Really? Oh, that would be difficult. That would be difficult to be in. Uh, are you weightless? Weightless? No, I think I found some weight to put on myself. Too much weight. <laughs> I love the silly creatures. Always there with a joke. <laughs> See, I'm not just funny looking. I'm funny sometimes too. A little bit. So some people here might say that you're an alien. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm a fraggle. We're a very dignified race and I visit outer space. It's a different thing. So tell me what Fraggle Rock is like, because I've wanted to go there since I was a kid. Fraggle Rock is endless caverns beneath the surface of outer space. And it's so beautiful down there. Every cavern looks different. And uh, well, in fact, when I was younger, I used to explore Fraggle Rock and I really never found the end of it. It just seems to go on and on and on. But now my, my nephew is, is exploring Fraggle Rock. My nephew is exploring Fraggle Rock now, and it's a wonderful, wonderful thing. So how do you get down in Fraggle Rock? How do you get to Fraggle Rock? Well, you have to go to Doc's workshop, and then you just get past the hairy creature that's in there, and then you simply crawl through a little hole, and poof, you're in Fraggle Rock. Well, you're about to have a great holiday celebration, just like us. But what are we going to see here on yours? Yes, every time it gets cold in the winter, we celebrate. And we have something called Night of the Lights. As, as you might be able to see here, we have a wonderful situation where we decorate with these things called glow grapes. They are our berries. They're sort of a berry or a grape or something that grows out in the Gorg's garden. And we pick them and bring them in and they start glowing and we decorate the whole rock with them. It's beautiful, aren't they? Well, you know what? I've been to, to outer space. I've, well, in fact, I went all around looking for holidays like ours, and I found that silly creatures, oh gosh, in the whole of outer space, seem to do the same thing. They use lights or candles or these little Bernie things that they use, and, and it's absolutely pretty, and the family gets together, and friends get together, and it's a warm, happy time of year. So what do you tell those younger creatures that want to explore and do what you do? Well, all you have to do is you just have to go into outer space and start looking around. That's all I do. I just see what I find, and I explain it to my nephew and his friends back in the rock. And what's the most fun thing that you found on your adventures all around? Oh, that's a tough one. The most fun thing I've found. Hmm. Well, not long ago, I was at a place called a water park, and it was tremendous fun, and I actually rescued some silly creatures who were scared. All right, who's the silliest of the silly creatures that you found? It might be me. Oh, that's, that, you're making a joke, aren't you? <laughs> that's very funny. That's very funny. Because they're all silly. <laughs> the things that silly creatures get up to. Mm. They're not dignified like fraggles. You're the king now. I'm the king? Love it. Happy to be crowned by you. King Dallas. How are you going to spend your holidays? Well, I'm going to uh, spend the holiday here in Fraggle Rock, you know, the night of the lights. It's a beautiful time of year. And then I expect to go back out to outer space. And oh my goodness, I've, had, I've gotten a lot of ideas today for places to go. I must go to Dallas. I'm supposed to go to Florida. 
And um, there are several other places that I have in mind. You never know. Keep your eyes open. I might show up. I hope you do. So what's the silliest thing that you see us silly creatures do? The silliest thing that silly creatures do? Let's see. That's a tough one. <laughs> so many to choose from. Um, oh, I find they have a transportation system that goes up and down and loop-de-loop. -loop. It's a strange thing. I believe they call it a roller coaster. So when you're traveling through space, where is it you come out of when you get here? Oh, I just come through the hole. There's a little hole that connects to Fraggle Rock. In, uh, it's in a, it's in a, inside Doc's workshop. There's a, there's a woman named Doc, a silly creature, who, may, who, who, who does some sort of experiments, and she has a hairy creature with her. And uh, it's a little scary to get through past the hairy creature because he always you know, yells at me and, and wants to catch me. But anyway, I'm going on too much. <laughs> oh, you think I could get through there with you? Well, uh, you, you're a little big to get through the hole. That's the first problem. So I think you would have to enlarge the hole and then come in. But, you know, the fact is, uh, is just, I don't think a silly creature would fit in Fraggle Rock. You're just too big. Ah, I told you I found some extra weight. It's been an absolute pleasure speaking with you. I hope you find this silly creature on your adventures the next time you're around. And we hope to talk to you again soon. Well, thank you very much. And you have a lovely night of the lights. Thank you, Uncle Traveling Matt. Safe travels. So long. Love to speak with you.